Hello folks and welcome to Linux Mint 21.3. This is made for brand new users. Filming in 1920 by 1080 so adjust your YouTube player accordingly. So you're watching this on Linux for Seniors. Uh, that's the name of my channel. Linux is for any age though. You should see this icon floating about uh, down here on the right if you'd like to subscribe. Uh, if you don't see that go find me on YouTube. I have lots of videos for you. So today I'm going to talk about this panel bar. As you can see, it's at the top. It normally is not there. It's normally at the bottom, like that. Now I have something special turned on also, which I'll discuss, which is a semi see-through or see-through panel bar. You can see part of the tree right through my custom icon here. And I also have videos on that. So if you right click on your panel bar and hit move, you'll pick new zones if you like. New positions, one, two, three. Now when you click this area, this will have less room than the one on the top. You can see there's more room in here. The menus still work the same and you can uh, resize the box by grabbing the corner if you like. Calendar looks like that. So when I turn on my web browser, actually this panel bar turns a different color. More grayish or blackish. All right, how do you, how do you turn this stuff on? Well, you can go to your settings also right click on your panel bar and settings are right here. You look for extensions and you turn on the transparent panels. This will normally be blank on a brand new install. You click that, find the arrow, click, it produces a check mark after it's installed. Then you click manage. It'll normally be off like this and this is how your panel bar normally looks like. Then you can click that. And depending on where this gear symbol is set, there's only three choices. Shadow, fully transparent, which I'm gonna turn on right now, and it makes your icons look like they're floating. And the other one is called semi-transparent, and you can just leave the defaults on. And if you don't like this anymore, turn it off. You can also uninstall it. It's that simple. I'm gonna turn mine back on, enable it in other words, and say thank you for watching.